Jake, how does it feel going into this season being a guy for an opening like this? You no, know, it definitely feels good. Yeah, um, especially a guy like Jake Rucker, Andre, you can sit back and just watch like the craft he gives in the game, just the way they play the game right away. It's really enjoyable to watch. And then for me to go out there and get my shot, you know, just playing baseball, I know that I can do it. How big is that for confidence to step into a new role and immediately have a big game? Uh, you know, it's good. I mean, confidence, you got always got to have it. It's, uh, it's tough once you lose your confidence and it's kind of hard to go out there and perform, but always have confidence that you can be able to do whatever you want. Yeah, I've been doing that first summer and talking to the What's the, the road jacket thing? Uh, so that's another Evan Russell creation. So okay. He got the little cheetah print, uh, it's a Tim coat, so <laughs> we like it. Uh, just put it on your shoulders and whatever. But hitting the first homer was pretty cool. Uh, definitely excited about it. We just had a chase on the mound today. Uh, definitely good. Like uh, we had a meeting after the game, and he just looked really collected, calm, and collected. Uh, it was a big role for him being the Friday guy, but he looked pretty out there for us. Anything surprise you? Or was that what you expected from him? Even I mean, despite his first career start, first career game. Yeah, I mean he's out there doing that to us. So like going up to another opponent, it was just if he could trust himself. I guess have a lot of new faces in the lineup. What's it like to see the, the production you had today from mostly new faces? Yeah, no, it's good. The guys, like even like Jordan Beck and Drew Bill and Evan Russell, they didn't perform the way they wanted to, but everybody knows what they can do. Everybody seen what they can do last year. So we're not worried about them, but the new faces in the lineup, it's pretty cool to see people actually getting the turn in front of them. What do you see from Jarrell? He's another guy that waited yeah. to get his shot, but we had that home run today. No, Jarrell's definitely a homie. He, uh, I'm sure you guys are going to talk to him, but he, he does everything the right way. He's always a team guy in the locker room, and it's kind of hard for me not to do it. Okay, what kept you here when you were having to work to turn a lot of guys? Baseball's kind of a transient sport. Guys moving here, here, keep staying. Why do you do that? I mean, I've always, always been told, don't quit. So that was, that was another one. Uh, and then just the people here, I mean, it's kind of hard to be honest with so I love it. What's your mindset this off season? Just knowing that it was finally going to be your turn, you're going to get your shot. Just what was your mindset kind of all off season? Uh, just trying not to get sped up. Just doing the same thing I was doing the past few years, but actually knowing that I was going to go out there and play on the field. So really just a mindset thing. Give you guys a couple innings to get going, but the offense kind of just picked up right where you guys left off last year before home runs. So they just talked a little bit about the offense. Uh, definitely was pretty cool to go out there and watch. I mean, earlier here in the field, uh, it was pretty fun to watch the guys out there take loose swings have good BP, and then, I don't know, we always knew we were going to get it done. Nobody was really that nervous in the dugout. We were always, like, we're going to get this done.